right? Shalom, shalom. First off, you want to give all praises to the Most High. Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahushai, Ba'ashem, Ba'ashem, All right, double honors unto the apostles and elders of great milkstone who well. Salutation to the elect. All right, we out here prophesying once again the downfall of this wicked ass place called America, spiritual Sodom and Eden, Babylon the Great. All right, and with all the things going on in the world right now, we can see that being the last days, man. All right, America is really slated for destruction. All right, and we see what's going on with all these draconian laws being passed. All right, in New York City. All right, uh, uh, they're passing noise decrees. All right, uh, 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 you gotta pay for uh, 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 to come into the city, all right? And they just passed a, a recent law where they can come into your crib, all right? And take you and put you in a concentration camp, man, all right? You don't have no legal recourse, all right? You can't call your lawyer, they can hold you indefinitely, and they, not, they don't even have to tell you where they're taking you, all right? So guess what, man? There's going to be a lot of bad times, perilous times coming out of the pipeline, you know, here in America, man. All right? God, this is look up Isaiah chapter 10, verse 1. One to them that decree unrighteous decrees. Yeah, that's right, man. And who's decreeing all these unrighteous decrees, man? All right? The so-called white man. All right? And we're going to see that more and more, you know, in these last days, man. A bunch of unrighteous decrees, man. All right? They squeeze in every ounce. Uh, 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 of life out of you people, man. Because guess what, man? The play, hey, the world is ruled by the wicked, man. All right, the scriptures say what, man? Uh, uh, when the wicked bear it ruled, you get that next one. Uh, you know, the, the people mourn. All right, and we're gonna come into a time of great mourning here in America, man. All right, you see the the, the 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 cost of living. All right, has gone up. You know, hyperinflation. All right. There's some items that's already uh, uh, went up 150 percent. Okay. Uh, uh, your, your, your salary is not uh, 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 reflecting, you know, the inflation that's going on. People can't pay rent. All right. You know, they squeezing you out with all these tickets, and eventually, man, hey, man, they gonna shut this shit down, man. All right. They had a thing on the news today, speaking about a potential blackout. All right. You know, right a day after, a few days, they, 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 they said that on the news a few days before that, a couple days before that, they put out that movie. Uh, what, what, what was the name of the movie? Was? Um, uh, it's on uh, Blackout on Long Island. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, 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 let me see. Leave, yeah, leave, yeah. leave the world behind. All right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a movie they just put out a couple days ago about a blackout in Long Island. Right? And quote unquote coincidentally, which there's no coincidences, all right? They got on the news about China hacking the infrastructure and there might, they might be blackouts going on, man. All right? So guess what, man? Hey, man, great uh, 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 terror is coming to America, man. All right? Okay. God, Isaiah chapter 10, verse 1. One to them that decree unrighteous decrees and that write grievousness which they have prescribed. Yeah, that's right, man. So these. Uh, the decrees, all right, is going to bring great grievousness, all right, to you people out here, man. All right, these people in America, they think shit, you know, it, it, this thing is going to last forever, but guess what, man? Shit ain't been the same since 2019. Yeah, that's right. Shit ain't been the same, all right? <laughs> you know, people are out here trying to get that feeling back, but guess what, man? It's never coming back, man. All right? America is done, okay? It's circling the drain, it's circling the drain. The glory of America is no more, man. All right? Okay? Got some more. Con, to turn aside the needy from judgment and to take away the right from the poor of my people that widows may be their prey and they, that they might, and that they may rob the farmer. Yeah, that's right, man. So guess what, man? Eventually, in all reality, they're going to charge the target you know, you Jake's first and foremost, man. You so-called blacks, Hispanics, and uh, Native Americans, man. All right? When the C-19 uh, uh, just started, you know, popping off, you got government officials saying, yo, uh, yeah, yeah, they were saying, they were saying, oh, we need it specifically for the blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. I, you know, he said just like that, man. Like, uh, where'd that come about? All right? So guess what, man? This man's about to come out 
with great wrath, man. All right? Yeah. Um, this is Isaiah 59 and 19. So shall they fear the name of the Lord from the west and his glory from the rising of the sun. Yeah, that's right, man. So show shall they fear the name of the Lord from the west. And guess what? All of these things, all right, is coming from the Lord, man. All right? Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. All right? He deals with the issues of life and death, man. All right, the Lord is the one that, that that's bringing uh, great evils, man. All right, and they're gonna fear the Lord from the West, man, here, here in America, man. Why is that? Because this place is the most wickedest kingdom in the history of the earth, man. All right? You go around, you walk around this place, hey, you, you, you wanna throw up, man. All right? A bunch of uh, homosexuals around here, all right? The woman is completely out of order. The family structure is, is completely gone. All right, the food you eat is fucked up. All right, you look, you look, you look at the ingredients for a food, for 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 for, for an item. This shit is like twenty ingredients of words that you don't even know. Right? It's all polluted. All right, chemtrails in the air. All right. You know the music, the music, this trap music. Uh. What's all the music? The drill music? That drill music? That demonic ass music? That these uh, 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 kids is pushing? All right? Everything around here is tainted, man. All right? You know, you go to a, you go to a school. All right, all right. Your kids gonna get a, a quote unquote so called education, right? Guess what, man? They got tr trannies reading to your kids in school, man. All right? Four or five years old. All right, you got reading days, you got a transgender reading to your kids, why? All right, goddamn freaks, you, can't, you know what I mean? Your kids don't have no type of uh, 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 safety, man. A lot of these kids, they ain't have no chance, they, they don't have a chance, man. You know? Isaiah 59 and 19. So shall they bear the name of the Lord from the west and his glory from the rising of the sun. When the enemy shall come in like a flood, the spirit of the Lord shall lift up a standard against him. Yeah, that's right, man. So the enemy is coming in like a flood, man. All right? The so-called white man, he's coming in like a flood. All right? And this, this is how we know, hey, this is not a carnal war, man. All right? When you so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans, man, hey, man, you think you're going to uh, go to war with the so-called white man? You think you're going to strap up and shoot it out with this guy? Hell no, nah, man. All right? For you to go against this man, you gotta have the spirit of the Lord. The Lord gotta be with you, man. All right? So I can just read that last part again? Uh-huh. When the enemy shall come in like a flood, right. the spirit of the Lord shall lift up a standard against him. Yeah, that's right, man. We're gonna be, li we, we be living in a time where you're gonna be seeing a lot of things you've never seen before, man. All right? Brother's gonna get what, man? That spiritual power. You're gonna see men created uh, 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 doing miracles, all right? You know, uh, 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 men uh, flying, all right? You know, men going to war, all right, against the so-called the so uh, 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 white man, you know, taking out 10 at a time, man, all right? These are the things you're gonna see uh, in these coming days, man, all right? You don't have to prep. You don't have to get guns. You don't have to uh, uh, have a stockpile of weapons. Because guess what, man? All of them things, that is not going to matter, man. All right? Brothers, you're going to see it, man. All right? We believe that. Yeah, brothers going to fly, man. We're going to be flying out here. And we're going to, we're going to, hey, man, we created havoc out here, man, against our enemies, man. Straight up. Uh -huh. This is um, Central Nationals 8 and 15. For many great miseries shall be done to them that and a lot of times shall dwell in the world because they have walked in great pride. Yeah, that's right, man. So many great miseries is coming, man. Hey, man, they already infiltrated these, these, these people with uh, this place with soldiers, man. All right? They already did that, man. All right? They already got these uh, 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 robot dogs and these humanoid robot, robot cyborgs and all of that. They already got all these things, all right, to unleash upon you people, man. All right? Walking around like shit is sweet, man. All right, but guess what? All of these things is coming from the Lord, all right? Because America is a place of great pride, all right? Do what you want, do how you feel, do, do as thou wilt. That's that type of attitude, man, all 
All right, they got a whole month called what? Pride Month, where they celebrated uh, 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 an abomination, man. Under the guise that everybody should be happy, man. Nah, man, fuck all of that, man. All right? If you're so called black and smiles and Native American, hey, your goal is to what, man? Please the Lord, man. All right, that's your, that, that, that's your function, man. All right? Serve the Lord and please him to the best of your, your ability, man. All right? Okay. Uh-huh. All right. This is verse 51. Right. But understand thou for thyself and seek out the glory for such as be like thee. Like-minded men. Right. right. That's right, man. That's what scripture is also going to uh, be not unequally yoked with unbelievers, man. Right. And I was very tipping on this before I came in, man. Hey, that's why you are not to get too close uh, to people in the world, man. You know what I mean? People that you work with and people in general, man. Right. You understand? Because really and truly, they, they're your enemies, man. And they're going to sell you out, man. Yep. But nine times out of ten, right. you understand? The majority of them, if they're in the world, if they're of the world, you understand? And they are, they, they are potential enemies, man. You understand? Yeah, no, that's right, man. That's right, man. Because guess what, man? That's correct. Be not uh, uh, equally yoked with unbelievers, man. Because in all reality, man, a lot of these people out here, they, they don't know what's going on, man. You know what I'm saying? They, they don't know what's going on. They, they think this shit gonna last forever, all right? And in all reality, you know, I had a couple friends from my, my past, you know, trying to link back up, but I'm like, yo, listen, I don't have nothing to talk to you about, bro. With all due respect, I ain't say that, but in my mind. You know what I'm saying? I, I ain't got nothing to talk to. What are you gonna talk about? Some old shit? Talk about some sports, some bitches, and then what, man? All right? Ain't nothing to talk about with these people out here, man. All right? Uh -huh. This is the book of Revelation, chapter 11, verse 8. And their dead bodies shall lie in the street of the great city, which spiritually is called Sodom and Egypt. Yeah, that's right. This place is what spiritually called Sodom and Egypt. All right? Why would it be called that? All right? Well, we already know what it is going on with, with these Sodomites. All right? You can't, hey, man, you can't, uh, 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 uh. Walk a block, all right. We're seeing a bunch of a goddamn homos, man. I don't know what it is. All right, that's what it is, man. All right, and not only that, man. This is the place where the children of Israel, all right, was held in, in, in captivity, man. All right. So read that again, bro. Revelation chapter eleven, verse eight, and their dead bodies. Right, their shall... dead bodies. You know, our people out here, they're spiritually dead, man. All right, they're spiritually dead. They have no idea what's going on. They don't. They don't tap in with their power. All right. They. 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 they, they they're, they're following all the. Uh, uh, they following after the heathen. All right. Following the gods of the heathen. Following the the, the so-called white man to their to their damnation, man. Okay. And I thought about that scripture because in all of these people, man, Jake specifically, when you see them walking by as we speak, man, right. they're dead bodies. Man. Headphones on, listening to drill music, listening to rap music. Right. You know what I mean? To Chichi Man walk by, right, to, uh, to a butch you walk by, you know what I mean? So on and so forth. My dogs were niggas walking by smoking our weed. You understand? Mm -hmm. that, that's, a, that's a dead state. Right? Right. You're the state of the, the Lord looking at you like a heathen. Right? You understand? Because really that's what we're concerned about. We're concerned about your so called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. Right? You understand? But well, you might as well be like any of these other heathens that, 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 are, that are spiritually dead men walking by, man. You understand? Yeah. Which is a which is a damn shame. You understand? Uh, that's right, man. Jake, Jake is gone, man. Jake is gone. They don't speak about, you know, you listen to you listen to their conversation, you know, that's why I wear headphones so I can listen to what people say. And <laughs> that's what I do. And you know what I mean? Jake ain't talking about nothing, man. The same bullshit over and over, man. Alright, you talking the same shit at 25, 35, 45, you talking the same bullshit over and over what's well, about to get real out here man all right it's about to get real out here man but hey a lot of people out here are going to die man straight up man all right die by the sword famine all right a lot of people are going to be put in concentration camps all right all these things coming out of the pipeline uh, uh, uh for these people to here in america man all right America lived lovely, man. America lived deliciously over the years, and guess what? That shit is done. It's at its end right now, man. Yeah, that's right. Did you finish reading that? I was not. Uh, was that more than that? 
Yeah, where also our Lord was crucified. Yeah, that's right, man. Where also our Lord was crucified, man. So guess what? Hey, man, they don't push, they don't push, all right, uh, 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 the standard of the Bible to these people, man. Which, of course, because why is that, man? The wicked, the wicked is in rulership, man. All right? All right? America has broken every law, statute, and commandment that's in the Bible, man. That's in the scriptures, man. Isaiah 5 and 20. All right? That, 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 that's in the scriptures, man. All right? It's pushing a bunch of wickedness on the God. Hey, they desecrated the rainbow. All right? The rainbow was a, uh, a, 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 a symbol, you know, from the Lord, all right, that he wanted to flood the, flood the earth with water again, man. And guess what, man? It's been desecrated to something uh, uh, abominable, man. Uh -huh. This is Isaiah 29 and 16. Surely your turning of things upside down shall be esteemed as the pot is clay. Yeah, that's right, man. So guess what? Surely, all right, so I'll get you again. I got you. Yeah. Isaiah 29 and 16. Surely your turning of things upside down Chapter Steve, as the pot is clay. Yeah, that's right, man. So here in America, man, they, they, they turn everything upside down, man. All right? They turn good into evil, evil into good, man. All right? That, that you know, uh, that, 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 that's how it goes here in America, man. Oh, you can do what you want. Yeah, that's good. That's, that, that's clearly evil. You could be a homosexual. Yeah, that's good. That's clearly evil, man. All right? You can cross-dress. All right? You got the woman out here wearing pants and jeans and, and they, they, they more masculine than a bunch of dudes out here. Everything is turned upside down and you know, they push it like, oh, we gotta accept that shit. I don't have to accept that shit, man. All right? The Lord don't accept it, we don't accept it, man. Straight up. Uh-huh. All right? Full shadow. Let me read that again. Surely it turned the things upside down. Shall be a sting. Shall be esteemed as a promise to win. the work say of whom that made it, he made it not. Or shall the big friend say of whom that framed it, he had no understanding. Yeah, that's right, man. So uh, the people out here, they, 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 they uh, 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 worship the, the, the creation more than the, than the creator, man. All right? You know, the Lord put all these laws, statutes, and commandments there for a reason, man. The scriptures say, hey, man, the commandments are not grievous. All right, it's for your own benefit. All right, and what our people do? Follow after the ways of the heathen, man. All right? Hey, bro, you might go to a restaurant. I think I'm paying a hundred plus dollars for some fucking lobster. What's wrong with you, man? Oh, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to surf and turf. All right, lobster, shrimp, all these type of things. All right, so I want, so I want. All right, you know? They push it as, as, as that's something, oh, we were, I'm born, I'm gonna spend some money on myself. And that's clearly going off, man. All right? This is Amos 3 and verse 1 and 2. Hear this word that the Lord has spoken against you, O children of Israel. Yeah, that's right, man. Guess what, man? The Lord is speaking to his chosen people, the children of Israel. You saw about blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. All right. And then you say this is what you Are the Israelites according to the scriptures? Right. Against the whole family yeah. which I brought up from the land of Egypt, yeah. saying. Yeah, that's right. Against the whole family. From the so called uh, 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 black man all the way down. All right, all right. You only have I known of all the families on the earth. Yeah, that's right, man. So guess what, man? The Lord, he, he don't love every man, everybody, man. All right? You got the chosen and you got the heathen. All right? All you other nations, you're of the heathen, all right? And guess what? For us being the chosen people of the Lord, guess what? The Lord won't deal with us first, man. Therefore, I will punish you for all your iniquity. Yeah, that's right, man. So the Lord won't start punishing the children of Israel for all their iniquities, all right? He's going to use that, the so-called white man as a sword, man, as a, 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 a hammer, man, all right? A lot of you so-called black Hispanics and Native Americans, they're just gonna go in jail, concentration camp, they're passing laws, they can kick in your door, and they can keep you locked up, you know, for a normal uh, 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 amount of time. And guess what, it's coming from the Lord, man. All right, you women out here being out of order, guess what? All right, that punishment that's coming down the pipeline 
is coming from the Lord, man. All right, you badass kids, guess what? You're not exempt either. Kids ain't exempt either, man. It's, it's in the scriptures. Guess what, man? All of these things is coming from the Lord, man. Great death is coming, is coming down the pipeline. Concentration camps. Yeah. Revelation 2 and 10. Fear none of those things which thou shalt suffer. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right, man. That's speaking about the elect, man. Alright, the people out here that are doing the will of Yahweh Shai. Alright, the men that come out of the highways and byways. Alright, studying to show they self approved. Alright? That's not that hey. That's, that, that's what that scripture is talking about. Fear none of these things, man. But the vast majority of people out here, they're not going to understand what's going on, man. Hey, the scriptures say that the Lord didn't give us a, 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 a spirit of fear. All right? All right? Fear none of those things which thou shalt suffer. It's a lot. Yeah, and it says, none of those things which thou shalt suffer. So guess what, man? Great suffering is coming in, down into the pipeline. Down the pipeline. All right? Some people are going to get thrown into prison. Some people are going to have their head chopped off, all right? People are going to be starving, they ain't going to be no food out here, all right? It's just about to get real out here, man. Behold, the devil shall cast some of you into prison. Yeah, that's right. The devil shall cast some of you into prison, all right? That's so, that's so called, uh, 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 the so-called white man, all right? They just passed that law uh, uh, maybe last week. All right, they passed it before. All right, somebody challenged it, and they the, the city appealed it, and now it's in the law, man. All right, they can kick in your door without reason. All right, and they put your ass in a concentration camp for an unlimited amount of time. You have no legal rights, right? You have no legal rights, and you don't know where the hell you're gonna be at. All right, that's what's coming down, man. That's coming down for everybody. All right, including hey, those the, the ones. Uh, that of the elect, but guess what, man? We have that carpet on your house about Shinya was shy, all right? Okay, no one can guess what? Everything, this is supposed to happen, and we're going to be all right, all right? Uh -huh. yeah, like you said, you know, we don't know where you're going to be at. Um, Revelation 2 and 10, let me start from the top again. I mean, 2 and 10. Yeah. Revelation 2 and 10, fear none of those things which thou shalt suffer. Behold, the devil shall cast some of you into prison, that ye may be tried, and ye shall have tribulation ten days. Be thou faithful unto death, and I will give thee a crown of life. Yeah, that's right, man. That's a, that's a message for the elect right there, man. All right? It says tribulation ten days, which that's, 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 that, that's just a, you know, a, 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 a number right there. But guess what, man? It says what? Be thou faithful unto death. All right, that's what it is. That's this is the kind of this this is this, this the climate is, 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 is we in right now, man. Be thou faithful unto death, and I'll give thee a crown of life, man. So guess what, man? Because yeah, they about to um, <laughs> said, be there faithful unto death. Because they about to give people these. They gonna issue these dog tags, right? Mandatory, right? That mark of the beast, that dog tag that you people gonna take because you trust in this government. I got some. Second Ezra chapter 15, verse 14. Woe to the world and them that dwell therein, <coughs> for the sword and the destruction draw at night. Yeah, that's right, man. So woe to the world and that uh, 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 dwell therein, the, and them that dwell therein, all right, because the sword and destruction draw at night. night. That's right, man. So guess what, man? Hey, man, great death is right around the corner. Hey, man, 2024 could be that year, all right? Because that's what, the whole earth right now is in an uproar, all right? The whole earth right now is on edge, man. We're, we're on the brink of World War III, man. Like, what are we talking about out here? We're on the brink of World War III, right. all right? Uh, nah, bro, you're right. Just, uh, just thinking about it, man. We're in December right now. Right. Uh, January is right around the corner. Two weeks. Yeah. Two weeks, yeah? Damn. Shit. And what is that, Mark? You ain't gonna have no happy new year, you people out here. Happy nuke year, right. <laughs> you ain't gonna have a happy new year, man. 2024 is gonna come with a bang. Happy nuke year. Yeah. 
economically, right. first and foremost. They don't care, they mainly, worry about some toast. Yeah. Right. They just, you damn people, all you care about is your nine to five jobs and your stupid weekend parties and your stupid, you know, whatever the hell you got going on in this world, man. Your futile, vain, dumb lives, mundane, day to day, top of top, social media bullshit, man. That's all you people care about, but hey, 2024, Lord willing, Yahweh Shem Yashai Rakhazah, whatever Apostle Tahar, the spirit of Yahweh Shem Yashai gave Apostle Tahar the name of the year, it's gonna be that. All right? But what we see projecting as we go forward, man, you people nine to five is gonna turn to a probably a nine to one, man. You're gonna, you're gonna get job cuts, a lot of more businesses are going out, all right, your damn pay cuts or whatever, you know. This thing, the, the, the economy of America is shot. The economic status of America is going down as we speak, man. It's 33 plus trillion dollars in debt and climbing. Yo, and that Bilderberg meeting, the first meeting, they labeled this economy, the world economies, and mainly the American economy, all economies as a guided missile. Because they go crash every day. They named it a guided missile. Hold on, you hear me? Well, a well guided missile. Y'all yeah, got those scriptures? Yeah, yeah, come, come. Second Ezra chapter 15, uh, verse four, 15. Mm -hmm. For the sword and their destruction dry nigh. Yeah, it said there's the sword and their destruction draw off nigh. Now, ultimately, that sword is going to be thermonuclear missiles, but we have to understand and remember that the Most High gave a nation on this earth the blessing of the sword. And they're ruling the earth right now, the Edomites, man. The scriptures say that a sword is furbished. It is made ready. That's the so-called white man and his military and his AI technology, his military strength, his uh, DARPA program, his Boston Dynamics programs, his disease warfare, okay? so-called white man is using uh what is that called economic weapons yeah um social engineering economic on war social engineering um, economic war on silent people. silent weapons silent weapons man all right you people are already you're ready for the slaughter all right you people are ready for the slaughter man okay because that's just gonna run throughout the streets of america all right military troops Okay? The scriptures say Egyptian against Egyptian. Mm -hmm. Anarchy. Martial law. Can you put okay. uh, this is Isaiah chapter 54, verse 16. It says, Behold, I have created the smith that blow up the coals in the fire. Behold, I have created the smith that blows the coals in the fire. Alright? The smith, alright, is the so called white man. The Edomite scientists that came up, or not came up, that were inspired, all right, to create the nuclear uh, bombs, man. First, it was atom bombs. You watch the movie Oppenheimer, man. His predecessor was a man by the name of Robert Abraham Esau. He started the uranium club. He was the one that kickstarted this whole nuclear technology thing. A man by the name of Robert Abraham Esau, you can look him up. He's the one that uh, gave Robert Oppenheimer the blueprint. It wasn't Robert Oppenheimer, man, that did all of it. All right? So that's what the scriptures talk about, these, these, these uh, nuclear scientists. All right? Because what did they do? They created uh, bombs that can destroy the damn entire world, man. All right, that could go from one continent to another continent and blow it off the map. Okay, well, that's the work of the Most High. Yeah. You know, Smith, right? Yeah. Nature World Smith, 
they they just could manipulate the elements. But now the modern day Smiths is these nuclear physicists, they they on they operate on a molecular level, right? That's the word. A molecular level. It's more sophisticated. And that bring it forth an instrument for his work. And what did they do? They brought forth that hydrogen bomb, that atom bomb, and the nuclear bomb. Okay? This is serious business. This is very serious business. I did a video a while ago, and I, and, I, and I had a picture of the ICBM, and I named the spirit, gave me the name of the video. This is not science fiction. This is real stuff. This is very, very dire, serious stuff. You're talking about nuclear missiles? Yeah. That's what the Bible's speaking about. Now, Trump is the evil of Well, it doesn't matter about whether Trump, you know, Trump is just a puppet. He's a puppet for the international elite. All right, that, that run all of this stuff, man. Okay? But that instrument is the nuclear missile, man. All right? Go ahead. And I have created the waster to destroy. And the waster to destroy. That's, that's what it's going to do. It's going to waste the cities of America and whatever other cities that the Most High allow the missiles to be shot on, man. All right? Because, yeah, man, you people ain't going to have a happy new year. Nope. 2024 will be. All right? Go ahead. It's Isaiah chapter 9, verse 5. And it says, for every battle of the warrior is with confused noise. Yeah, in the ancient world, they would have hand-to-hand -hand combat. All right? You watch the movies like Brave Heart, right? What other ones out there, bro? 300, 300 yeah. Troy. There you go, 300 Troy in the water. Yeah, that's it, there you go. Yeah, you know? That's what the scripture's talking about right there. Every battle of the warrior is for with confused noise. All right, men got spears, shields, lances, axes, okay? Yeah, uh, uh, bows and arrows, right? It says, for every battle of the warriors with confused noise and garments rolled in blood. Men getting their limbs chopped off. That was the ancient world battles. Now, this so-called white man, he got the damn, what, firearm. Firearms, man. <laughs> Rambo and shit, man. You know? They don't got they don't gotta do the ancient world, you know, hand-to-hand -hand combat. You don't gotta know any fighting styles or techniques to shoot a goddamn gun, man. Alright? Go ahead. It says, a garment roll in blood, but this shall be with burning and fuel of fire. Hey, don't Burn, that burning is those good firearms, man. All them, all that gunpowder, a uh, gunfire, man. And then it's going to accumulate into where the missiles are going to come up, uh, come overhead, and it's it's a wreck. Okay. Hey, man, we heading into some serious, serious times, man. There's going to be a lot of dead bodies out here, especially you women. You women ain't got a chance in hell. You ain't got a chance in hell. And we ain't gonna want you in those days. You best to know and be assured of that. We ain't gonna want no nasty, disgusting, ran through dot in America. You gonna get fed to the wolves and the, you know, the other damn scavenger animals, the vultures out here. You know what I'm saying? That's what you people are. First Thessalonians 5 and 3. For when they shall say peace is safety, then sudden destruction cometh upon them as travail upon a woman with child. What do they say for 2024? Same thing they said every year leading up to 2024. Peace in the Middle East and since. When was there peace in the Middle East? Hell, they had years ago, 
uh, 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 footage popped up of what was allegedly Joe Biden, because even that's questionable. Is this even the same guy that was there in the early 90s? It looked like a totally different guy, man. Anyway, allegedly Joe Biden. Right, right, right. right. Are they even, can you really look at it, the comparison is like, is this even the same person? Yeah, the sound mind, right? Sort of, right? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. But anyway, besides the point, all right, footy surface, he said that what? We're going to have to invent an Israel. That devil said that years ago. He said, we're going to have to invent an Israel. You know what I'm saying? There was never no peace in the so-called Middle East, man. All right? What just happened this year? Palestine and the Gaza Strip. Them rats and them sand towel heads, man. <laughs> that was it in a minute, right? It'll blow the dust off of that one. The towel heads and the yarmulke heads going at it. That's what I'm going to start calling it. Because we know we got to be censored when we say the J E W word. So let me just call them yarmulke heads, man. You bunch of yarmulke head hook nose people, man. That run every goddamn thing. You're gonna pay, man. Alright? There's no peace and safety. There's no peace and safety, man. That shit, I guess they've had a ceasefire, right? Allegedly. They had a ceasefire. But what, what, what is that what does that mean when they have a vendetta against you? The tower heads got a vendetta against you, Yamaka heads. There's never gonna be no peace because that land don't belong to you. You either, you you two either way, man. But let's take a, let's talk about America. America was got by violence, rape, robbery, and murder of you so-called black Latinos and Native Americans. Since when was there peace and safety for you? You still getting shot down in the damn streets. You still being oppressed. You still being called niggas, spicks, and wetbacks. Cut them off from being a nation. You, you still being called niggers, spits, and wetbacks till this day. Where's the peace and safety? Ask the so-called KKK, where's the peace and safety? Uh, ask the ADL, where's the peace and safety? Ask the NA double Oh, what is that? N A A C N A C P. Where's the peace and safety? There ain't no damn peace and safety. That's the damn well, modern day Black Lives Matter movement. Where's the peace and safety? And they just disguising that. They just that's just L G B T Q in disguise. There ain't no such thing as Black Lives. That's just the the, the, the so called rainbow flag in disguise. You know what I'm saying? The so-called white man never cared about the plight of you so-called blacks, Latinos, Native Americans. And he still don't give a damn. Go ahead. Yeah. First Thessalonians 5 and 3. For when they shall say peace and safety, then sudden destruction cometh upon them as travail upon a woman with child, and they shall not escape. Man, do you know what that means? That means America's gonna face some serious hell. It says sudden destruction gonna come upon them, man. That's what the Lord got in store for America. Sudden destruction, not peace and safety. Scriptures say there is no peace unto the wicked. Right. You know? So these are the times that we're in. You ain't gonna have a happy new year, people. Repeating that, Lord willing. As long as the Spirit's on me. Go ahead. Got it out here. Alright, bring it up. Second Ezra chapter 15, verse 15. For the sword and the destruction draw nigh, and one people shall stand up and fight against another, and swords in their hands. Yeah, that's right, man. So one people will fight and stand up against another with swords in their hands, man. Alright, as the brother was saying, man, ain't no peace. Alright? 
we come into the time where it's going to be what, man? Every man for himself. All right? You think, yo, you got a best friend? You guys grew up together? You went to nursery school together and you, you 30 years old best friends? Guess what, man? All of that shit go out the window, man. All right? can't eat when you when, when you can't eat all that friendship go out the window I tell you that right now some of you women out here you gonna eat your kids right. all right you're gonna be a, it's, it's gonna be your, your child on the menu man barbecue baby you know what I mean baked boiled and all of that man that's what's coming on the pipeline all right right John second Ezra chapter 15 <coughs> verse uh, 16 for there shall be sedition among men and invading one another. They shall not regard their kings nor princes. Yeah, that's right, man. Guess what, man? Hey, man. This squeeze, you see what's going on in New York City? Guess what, man? Hey, man. A lot of people, hey, they're not going to be listening uh, 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 to the mayor or the governor and all that, man. Hell no, man. It's going to be a great uproar of people out here, man. New York City, I can't wait to see it, man. Lord willing, man. Alright? I can't wait to see it, man. I hate this place, man. Uh, Alright? So uh, 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 I'm sorry. Go ahead, go ahead. The definition for sedition. Conduct or speech inciting people to rebel against the authority of a state or a monarch. Yeah, that's right, man. So you're going to see a lot of people rebelling. Alright, yo, bro. When they come again with, with a, uh, they new disease or whatever they got going on, and you got to take more of uh, them jabs, alright? You got to take more of them jump shots, Guess what, man? Hey, man, the people are going to rebel, man. All right? Because guess what? The, the, the people don't really see what's going on. They see what's going on. All right? And they, they remember what happened the last time, and they realize it was a bunch of bullshit. But guess what? This man is the devil, and he's trying to accomplish, you know, whatever plan he got, his diabolical plan that he got going on. All right? All right? To get rid of you people. All right? To put the, uh, 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 that MOTB in, in you people, that microchip in you people. All right? And guess what, man? People are going to rebel against all these things, man. All right? God. <clears throat> Second Ezra chapter 15, <coughs> verse 16. For there shall be sedition among men, and invading one another. They shall not regard their kings nor princes, and the course of their actions shall stand in their power. Yeah, that's right, man. So guess what? Nobody taking directions from uh, the mayor, the governor, all right, the president or whatever it is, man. People are going to have to do what they're going to do, man. It's going to be every man for himself in that day, man. All right? No, yeah, you, you, you can't really tell a man too much things when he can't eat. Man. You know what I mean? All right, and these Americans out here, guess what, man? They don't fast. They don't, you know what I mean? They really eat three meals, three, four meals a day. That's wild right there. That's a lot of, that's a lot, that's a lot of food, man. All right? Yeah, right, exactly. All right? There's GMO foods that these people eat in there. Guess what, man? It takes two to three days, man. Two, three days, all right? And people are going to be on edge, man. Everybody, you might have a woman, she say, well, I'm hangry. I'm hangry. Yeah, we're going to see a lot of hangry motherfuckers out here when that time comes. All right? Go ahead. Second Ezra chapter 15, verse 17. A man shall desire to go into a city and shall not be able. Yeah, that's right, man. A man shall desire to go into a city and shall not be able. All right, you think you're going to uh, 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 move to another state? Right. You know what I mean? Yeah. You know what I mean? That's, that's, that's the answer. That's the golden grail. <laughs> right, right, right. <laughs> you know, that's the master plan. Let's get out of New York State. Everything's fine. Let's get an RV, babe. Right. You know fucking I mean? just go across country, man, and live on the fucking road. Right. That's not the master. <laughs> you remember That's that the chick was Remember the chick was at the investor, the, the investor chick was watching the other day. She said she wanted to retire and go live in the mountains. Right. Like um, what's that um, um Montana and all of that. Right. Nah, <laughs> man. Yeah, yeah, we got isolated it. from the people. <laughs> yeah, we got and safety. Up. And safety. That's, That's, right, what, she, That's what she did. Uh, and you know that's all good, bro. Cause I know, cause I know through experience, that's pretty much what the type of shit you you females, you women are on. You think that you, you know what I'm saying, that you can get an RV. You know what I'm saying, just live on the fucking road in the RV or some shit. You can expect, you can escape the inner city. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. There you go. There you go. Yeah. No doubt. No doubt. But even in that time, 50-50 ain't gonna matter. 
Yeah. You gonna need your help watching me outside. Alright. <laughs> See, that's what we talking about up here. You know what I'm saying? You ain't gonna be able to escape this judgment that's coming. You can get a damn RV. You can go and plan to live on the road and you know say freelance yourself. You can do that now. But when there's no gas and there's no lights and there's utter chaos and anarchy going on, all that shit going out the window. You're going to end up like that, 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 that the wife of the dude on the road. That's how these women going to be. what she do? She couldn't take it. Here it is. They was, at the time, safe and sound, were they not? They were safe and sound in the house. But she said, fuck this. I can't. They're going to come and rape uh, me and your son. And I'm, I'm going to just, I'm just, I'm just give up. You know what I'm saying? But that's, that's the mindset of you people. You people going to fall to that fate. After the elect of Israel, man. All right? Uh, Amos 5 and 19. As if a man did flee from a lion right. and a bear met him right. or went into the house and leaned in his hand on the wall and a serpent bit him. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's, yeah, that's right, man. So that's, hey, man, that's, that's, that's the day of the Lord right there, man. All right? Ain't no escaping, man. That's right, bro. Ain't no escaping, man. You think you're gonna run up on the IV? You yo, I'm gonna go uh live off the grid. Yeah, that's you it. You know what I mean? I'm gonna go live in the woods, yep. woods and live off the grid. Right. Hell no, nah, man. Right. All right. The scriptures speak about here those in the wilderness dying by the famine, man. All right, dying by famine. So guess what, man? Ain't no escaping. All right. The judgment of the Lord, man. The great evils that He's about to bring to this place, man. Ain't nowhere to go. Ain't nowhere to hide, man. All right? America and the people in it are slated for destruction, man. All right? That's what it is, man. You oh, you think you get away? Oh, uh, you got something to... What you gonna do when that alarm go off and you hear, hey, man, find cover, the nukes is flying. What you gonna do? Yeah. Ain't, no, ain't nowhere to go, ain't, no, ain't nowhere to run, ain't nowhere to hide, man. Fits your wicked ass goodbye. That's right, man. All right? And guess what, man? Hey, them, 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 them nukes, they gonna have the spirit of the Lord on them, That's man. Right, bro. You know what I mean? He said the arrows are sharp and shall not miss, man. When they begin to be shot from the ends of the earth. All right? So that's what it is, man. All right? America got a lot of enemies in this world, man. They're going to have to pay for all the sins that they have done, man. All right? Say more? More? Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Second Ezra, <clears throat> chapter 16, uh, verse 18. Salakia. So, so Second Ezra, chapter 15. Verse 18, for because of their pride, the cities shall be troubled, the houses shall be destroyed, and men shall be afraid. And yeah, that's right, man, for because of pride, man. All right, this place called America is a very prideful place. Extreme. All right? Extreme. Yeah, pride days. All right, oh, we, we America, the, the proud, the, 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 the great, the Marines, and then, you know, everything, everything that they got, all right, it, it includes uh, 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 pride, man. And that's like also against pride against the Lord, man. All right? All right? Uh, 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 breaking every law, statute, and commandment. You know? Oh, we're going to do our own thing. You know, we, we know better than the Lord, man. Right. I mean, that's how these people think. Oh, we know better. All right? They just creating their own sun. You know what I mean? Creating their own rain. All right? Cre trying to create their own clouds spying on you. All right? Yeah, these people think that, they, that, that they're the Lord, man. Right. All right? But in, in, in that time, you're going to see who, who, who's really the Lord, man. That this man is the basis of men. All right? All right? He's a servant upon a, ho a horse. So, like, just read the last part of that again. Con, Second Ezra chapter 15, verse 18. For because of their pride, the city shall be troubled, the houses shall be destroyed, and men shall be afraid. Yeah, that's right. And men shall be afraid, man. <clears throat> all right? So if the men is going to be afraid... All right, the men are going to be shaking in their boots. All right, what's the deal with the women? Where where the woman going to be? All right, yeah. trust me. Ain't no independent woman right now in the Ukraine right now. I'll tell you that right now. Ain't no feminist. All right. All right, none of that shit. All, right. all of that shit going to go out the window. All right, when it comes to you women, man. All that shit going to go out the window. All right? All right. Zephaniah chapter 1 verse 12 And it shall come to pass at that time that I will set Jerusalem with candles and put a cement that are set up on their knees 
God say in their heart, the Lord will not do good, neither will he do evil. Yeah, that's right. And a lot of our people out here, they live living wickedly. All right, their whole life they live wickedly. And they will repent, man. All right, niggas out here doing drugs, selling drugs to their people. All right, uh, uh, they download homos. All right. Okay, they, they download homos, committing, committing adultery. All right, acting like, hey, man, ain't no judgment for your actions. But guess what, man? Guess what, man? Hey, man, the judgment is going to show itself uh, 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 from the Lord very soon, man. All right? Our people have taken the way of the heathen, and they think that's, 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 that's the way to live, man. All right, putting a bunch of tattoos on their body. You know what I'm saying? You know, living the way of the heathen. But guess what, man? The Lord don't give a fuck about the heathen, man. And that's why... Uh, 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 the vast majority of these heathen that they are going to die, all right. And you, 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 Jakes that follow, follow. You're back, you're back. All right, you Jakes that follow them, all right. You're going to die with them, man. All right, the scripture say what? Though hand, uh, uh, joined in hand with the wicked, all right, they shall not go uh, unpunished, man. Roughly paraphrasing. All right. Okay, so judgment going to start from the house of the Lord first. And you Israelites, man, you talk about blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans, all right? You better repent, okay? That's it, that's it, that's one right here. Verse 13, therefore their goods shall become a booty, and their houses a desolation. They shall also build houses, but not inhabit them. And they shall plant vineyards, <coughs> but not drink the wine thereof. Yeah, that's right, man, so guess what, man? America, the so-called land of America, it's over, man. All right, niggas thinking I'm talking about plans for the, these grand plans for the future. All right, all these construction buildings, all these buildings going up. Oh, this is going to be, uh, this building's going to be completed by 2030. Uh, 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 it's going to have all the uh, amenities that you need. All right, you know, they're trying to push these uh, 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 smart cities or whatever it is. All right, where you went, 15-minute cities or however, however you say it. Guess what, man? All of these things is going to come to naught, man. All right? It's going to come to naught, you know? And that's why we're not investing in this place, man. We ain't investing in this place, man. All right? I was listening to the brother today. It's like, yo, listen, you're doing all these things for a paycheck, and in a, in a little while here, your paycheck, that shit ain't going to even matter. All right? Your job, all of that, that shit ain't going to even gonna matter, man. All right? These grand, these grand plans for the future, it's not gonna Yo, check this shit out, brother. Uh -huh. Ain't this about a goddamn bitch and a half <laughs> that for you to accumulate your check, it takes you longer to accumulate your check than to actually spend it. Bro. Your shit don't last, man. Yep. As much work as it took you to get that check, it don't take it, it don't last as long as it took you to get it. Right. It goes quicker, way quicker than as long as you took the work uh, to get the to work for it. Man. Bag with holes. Bag with holes. Mm. You doing all this damn work and all this hours and then you get that lump sum or whatever the fuck you get and it goes like that. Yep. Yep. You know, it doesn't last as long as it took you to get it. You think that oh, this should last me a whole entire week. My old my check. No, it don't. Not in this goddamn world, man. And it's a goddamn, <laughs> this shit, this, this place gotta be destroyed, man. Right. It's wicked as hell. Yep. All right, that's why we crying out, brothers. You know what I mean? That's why we crying out. What the hell's wrong with you, damn niggas out here, man? You are homeborn slaves, yeah. and you going to take that chip, and you gonna get burned with throwing nuclear fire with your daddy, Esau Edom. <laughs> yep. I got something. Proverbs eleven and twenty one. Though hand join the hand, the wicked shall not be unpunished, but the seed of the righteous shall be delivered. Yeah, that's right, man. So you people out here, oh, I did everything, man. You know, uh, 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 you know, I did the work. I got a four hundred one k. You know what I'm saying? You know that people, li all people living the way of the so-called white man, and they don't think they're gonna, they're gonna uh, 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 be punished, man. Yeah. Well, as a brother say, man, hey, man, you're going to die with your daddy, the so-called white man. You continue following his ways, man. All right? Committing adultery. All right? Dealing drugs and all of these things, man. All of that shit come from the so-called white man. Pushing that shit down our people's trope, man. And our people defend that shit. Defend the wickedness. 
You know, like 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 it's gusto, man. Uh, right. Bitch, will die in that hell, man. Right. I, I do what I want to do here. Bitch, what's wrong with you? All right. The results speak for themselves. You look around the society, all this shit this man is pushing. Tell me the society's a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a 1776 to 1930. That's how long it took the so-called white man to annex this whole land from Gad and Issachar and Reuben and uh, Ephraim and Simeon and Zebulun, right? Naphtali and Asher and uh, Manasseh. He got the North, Central, and the South America. It took him till 1930 to really get the, get get his uh his uh his uh his uh, rocks off. So we're, we're, he had everything on lock now. Everything is on lock. The Israelites are oppressed. They're through. They're in slavery. All right, we got these people. Now, now we can benefit off of them and, and make our make our country, our establishment great. Go ahead. This is Habakkuk two and twelve. Woe to him that built it for town with blood. That's how America was built it with blood. Go ahead. Establishing a city by iniquity. That's how America was built. All of this was built it off of blood, man. All right, very, very grim reality, man. A very grim reality, but sobering to let you know where the hell you are. Don't you know what happens on these in these areas, on this very land that we're standing on? to the so-called Lenape Indians, because that's who the land of Manhattan belonged to. This belonged to the Lenape Indians, bro. They're heavy over there in Ohio now, but they got wiped out over here. Right. Yeah. New Jersey. And New Jersey too, man. Yeah. You see? This island of Manhattan belonged to the Lenape Indians, which is a tribe of Gad, of course. But you know, that's just Manhattan itself. We're not talking about Bronx. We're not talking about Staten Island. We're not talking about Brooklyn and Queens. That's just Manhattan alone. Go figure, right? What what Indian tribes, so-called Indian tribes, was in Staten Island? That's a good that's a good research. What 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 so-called Native Americans was in, was in the Bronx? That's good research. What about Queens? That's good research. Brooklyn, you know? Got to got to you know? And that's just New York City itself. We talking about the whole 5,000 square miles. The East Coast to the West Coast. Esau annexed this shit since from 1776 to 1930. And then in 1930, I believe the damn, uh, the, the economy collapsed, man. Uh, that was during the time of the what? The, the Great Depression, right? 1920s up to the- Okay, the water, bro. There you go. So look, man, we got the timeline. You got the timeline, bro. That's why I, I wholeheartedly agree with those brothers out there in Dallas. You gotta know where the hell you, Jake don't know where they at. It's like niggas acting like you don't know where you at. Do you right. know what happened right. to your ancestors here? You have any idea what happened to your ancestors here, man? Well, you you gonna find out. Right. So-called white man's gonna show you niggas that he never loved you. He was just bamboozling you and making you be like him to only just for you to fucking uh, 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 try to uh, give up your uh, your dignity, man. This they damn don't gotta, they, don't gotta, they don't gotta strap you and hang you on trees anymore, man. They got the pen and the paper. Right. And abortion clinics and the drugs and, and things like that, man. 
They 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 got more sophisticated. That's a saying. You got it. The pen is mightier than the sword. That's right. And that's more that's right now in effect more than ever, man. For the so-called white man. Right? The pen is mightier than the sword, man. You understand? Check that out, man. The pen is mightier than the sword, man. The pen is mightier than the sword. That's why they got all these things that's coming out of the pipeline. It's in law. Hey, how we open up? He wet his tongue. He wet his tongue. He wet his tongue like a sword. That that legislation he passed, man. You got it. Unrighteous decrees, man. How you do a decree? You do a decree with a stroke of a pen, man. You don't do it with a sword. You put you put the pen, and then sword comes after, man. You understand? Book of Sharap, Ecclesiastes chapter 28, verse 13. Curse the whisperer and double tongue, for such have destroyed many that are at peace. A backbiting tongue hath disquieted many, and driven them from nation to nation. Strong cities have been pulled down, and overthrown the houses of great men. Okay. okay. That's right, man. So guess what, man? This is man who puts everything in, in legislation, put it in, 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 in his laws. Right? He might go, he might do a, 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 an address to the nation, all right? Uh, what do you call that when, when you just, uh, instead of passing a law, you just, uh, you, executive, you, you, you write executive, a, the, the executive orders, orders and all these things, man, all right? So this man, he's letting you know what he's about to do before he does it, man, and with his laws, man, all right? And as the brother said, man, you people don't know where the hell you at, man, all right? You don't know where you at. This one is a commodity of Wall Street is with slaves. Right. All right, a bunch of buildings found in the financial district is on top of, 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 of graveyards, man. That's right. All right? So you niggas out here that think that, you know, these people love you out here, you're going to find out, man. You're going to find out real soon, you know, Lord willing. Absolutely. And with that, we will that? praise his honor and glory to your house. Double honor to the head elders, the apostles, and bishops of Great Millstone. Shalom to you, Akim, out there. Lord willing, until next time. All right, shalom. 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 Shalom.